Hello everyone, this is Ross here for Xbox Gamer Reviews and today we're taking a look at Doling's Arcade. This is available on the 3rd of August 2018, priced at £3.99, it's about $4.99, €4.99. Right, without any further ado, let's jump into it and check it out. That's just a quick how to play before we get going, hit and heal, hit these Dolings to heal them and earn points to do combo hits to earn more points. Uh, collect stars for better rewards and lives for extra lives. Stay away from falling targets to avoid any points lost and slow down. Keep an eye out for the progress bar at the top of the and get ready for the new targets from above. So let's, let's crack on. That. So aim is A, so we can switch between the two sides like so. X is to throw the ball and Y show off. Okay, so let's uh, let's go this side. So it's got a bit of that breakout old school breakout style smash your way through the targets oh we lost the ball there not, not paying attention i right, have got a life back anyway um, yeah so a bit of old school breakout action show off. Oh, we can do the show off now so let's try that in a second let's press Y for that do what it needs to do up there. Right, show off. So it gives us a colour ball. And let's bounce it off of there, let's go. That's timed as well, so you can see the colour ball being timed. Oh, before I lost it, it's timed on the right hand side of the screen at the top there. Right, let's try that. The end is nine. Right, so it must mean that the time is running out. It's tricky to get it when they're just a handful left. There we go. Travel complete. Not bad, not bad. Okay. <laughs> right, let's move on. Right, so this is telling us about the show off. So we click the thumbs up as they fall down to fill the meter. Uh, to light, light up the 10 spotlights. Right, you can see there's in the bottom left and the bottom right of the screen the spotlights. They all have to light up to give you the show off. And when the show off pops up, we press the Y button. Right, fair enough. We sort of learned that in the uh, first level. Three more to go. Show off. There we go. Let's use it now, I suppose. Got an extra life there. Right, let's use it here. back once it's finished. Um, let's get it in there. The end is nice. Tricky trying to catch the thumbs when they, the ball is going in the opposite direction than where you need to be. More, let's go. Now that was rubbish as well. 
All right, let's uh, move on again. All right, so this time we get a new persona. So if we get the helix just as they come down, we turn into Smash. Um, and he has a thunderclap. So obviously it's based on the Hulk, that character there. Let's do this. All right, let's see if we can get one of these to come down then. Save that show off. If we turn into the uh, Hulk style one, there it comes. There we go. All right, let's use that. There we go. And the other two uh, falling characters were in the way. Right, let's. Uh, how much time left on this level now, anyway? Come on, let's get the ball over there. There we go. So, what's next? Absolutely rubbish on that level. <laughs> Right, I've skipped it forward a few levels now just to so we can see it as, as a little bit this. more difficult. So let's see how we get on this time. Come on, try and get inside the uh, thing and grab the helix. That was close. There, please. Show off. There we go. Oh, I missed the ball. <laughs> Completely missed it. Show off. Right, let's turn that that way. Get a bit closer there. Use the colour ball. We oh, nearly lost it again then. Last couple. It'll be very difficult to get our last one now. No chance. <laughs> And that's enough of the gameplay just there. So what we can do as well, quickly while we're on the, the level select screen, you can press 
left bumper to go over to the left side of the screen that's go back to the main menu this button here is the leaderboards um, I can press right bumper and go over to the other side we've got options so we've got our languages I'll quickly scroll through these so you guys can see we have hints on or off music sliders down the bottom there controller setup it looks like we can change some stuff here so sensitivity um, I don't know if we can reassign buttons I don't think we can no right so there's the uh, controller setup anyway and they've got your credits there as well so let's just quickly back out of that um, and then finally we've got the DNA thing over there which is um, like upgrades for each character so you've got your, your standard character here um, and we can add um, extended colour ball 2 economic colour ball 2 and there's a third one there um, but you need as you can see there 30 of the health potions we've only got two there at the bottom right of the screen so we can't actually do any upgrades at the minute we've done the first two anyway earlier on um, we can scroll through the different characters that the game will have so we've already seen smash you've got gunner robo webster bedrock spook so there's extra characters to sort of get on play to play as and uh, obviously change the, the gameplay up a little bit as you play through the game um, so yeah that's pretty much it so this has been a look at Dueling's Arcade as we said earlier on it's going to be available on the 3rd of August so go and check it out if you're interested hope this video has given you a nice little insight to the game what it looks like what it plays like if it does please leave a like on it thank you so much for watching and we'll see you soon